Start the paperwork. I'm innocent. You know it. I want him to be transferred to prison Tell today. Her what Annaline did in the graveyard. Zerg's not smart enough to be the mastermind behind all of this. What? Think about it. Both these operations took meticulous planning, right? Zerg can't even plan a proper lie. I'm, I'm sorry, I, are you second guessing me now? Listen, just this morning you croaked at me for not having your back. Do you know why that is? No, and I... Okay, well, I'll tell you. You remember the night I got shot? I asked you to wait for me, right? But you had a lead. You had to follow. Grace, I couldn't wait. Rule number one is you never go without your partner. If you're the laughing stock of this precinct, it's because you never listen. What are you trying to say, Grace? I'm saying we can't make the stick without the gun. You know it, and I know it. Hey, to Moscow to whisper. Talk so I can hear you, man. You know everyone's dead, huh? So there's no reason for you to uh, protect your boss. So who was he? Was it that spiker lighting? Is that why he was in the control? Sorry, sorry, I, I can't hear you. <laughs> Were you taking your orders from him? Yes. Yeah, all right, yeah. So he was the one that was behind all of this. Huh? Me? Yeah! It was his ass following his plan. So you knew about the, the secret hiding place in the floor, huh? Sorry! Ah! I found it when you was out. Okay, so I did hiding with stuff. Stuff like ransom money. Yeah. I found a stained banknote stuck in the floorboards. So I requested the serial numbers from the ransom bills. Those banknotes were from the ransom bills for Marcus King. You've just implicated yourself in the kidnapping for Marcus King, cruel boom. Boom! So much for a routine suspension. They confiscated my gun and my appointment card. How long is this suspension gonna be? Did it give you time? It's still to be decided. Thank you, Graves, for standing up for me, ever since, especially since I've been nothing but a terrible partner to you. Hey, hey, just don't get soft on me, okay? No, man. It's, uh, it's the sugar rush. It makes me emotionally unstable. <clears throat> now you send it. What? The serial numbers from that lady from the casino. If you had sent them yesterday, woman. Want me to check it out for you? Um... Uh, forget about it. No, man, don't, don't get so sensitive. This has pretty much been my case since you've been away. No, no, sweet. I don't know why I offered. I should know by now. Okay, I will forward you this email. And then you can run a check and see if, if these serial numbers match the, the note that I found. Be sure you trust me now with your evidence. Okay, Graves, fine. Look, I need your help, okay? I'm not allowed back in that evidence room. It's not right. Yeah. There's nothing we can do about it, but all we need is just to get a match with that note and then get our guy. And then we get your suspension lifted. Exactly. You can count on me, partner. You're the only friend I have in this place. Thank you.
you get the results? Detective? In West Isle that night, did anyone see you retrieve that banknote from the floorboards? Um, no. Are you sure? Yeah. Did you tell anyone about it? I... I, 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 I put the note in the evidence bag myself, and, and someone must have seen me do that, but why? Because the numbers don't match. Um, that's not possible. I checked it with my own eyes. Oh, then it means that someone swapped it out. Uh, what are you saying, Mumby? Hey? Are you uh, accusing me uh, of tampering with evidence? No, it, of course not. It's just that, uh... It's just that I, I put the evidence in the evidence bag myself, so it means that either someone swapped the... Either someone planted false stained banknotes in the bag, or it means that someone has swapped out the banknotes, which means that Krutboom has someone on the inside. The question is... Who? 